Located by the hills of Mission Peak, the Washington Township Local History Museum shares the history of the cities of Fremont, Union City, and Newark. It's a combined collection. There were two local historical societies, the Washington Township Historical Society and the Mission Peak Heritage Foundation. And they came together to pool their resources to uh, build this, you know, to, to collect and to hold this stuff in this museum. We needed some place to put all this. And at one time in, um, in 1909, it was known as Washington Township and it was Union City, Newark, and the five little towns. The museum hosts various exhibits centered on history in both the local area and California at large. We have the nucleus of our collection is a, is a collection of photographs that a local doctor uh, managed to get in the 1960s and 70s. Before there were scanners, he would take pictures of some of the early family's photographs. Uh, I think one of my favorite is, is the Gold Rush. The gold rush, also the the aerial of the of of er, no of Niles, because we're so we were, when we started out, this was so agriculture. We lot we grew a lot of things here, and it and then after agriculture, it became you know more cityfied, and things changed. Workers and volunteers share knowledge on the exhibits in the museum and the stories behind pieces in them. I kind of like the ostrich egg over in the display cabinet because it, it's a real cute story about boys in the 1890s were fascinated with, they, they collected things, and so they collected bird eggs. And most of the bird eggs in that exhibit are local birds that you just find you know, out in the fields. But there's an ostrich egg in there. The story is that there was an ostrich farm in, near Fresno and they were trying to raise ostriches commercially. So the little boy that had the, ostrich collect, the egg collection here traded an egg for the ostrich egg from Fresno, he hoped he could hatch it, but of course it didn't. So then he just put it in his collection. The museum staff share their thoughts on why the museum and local history are so important. I think all history is important, that we need to know where we've come from, what made things happen the way they happened, so we can know where we're going. And I think it's a good idea to have a lot of information about the people who came before us. History in the past was written by the people who um, we're the most important people, and we're trying to be a little more uh, expansive in doing some of the histories of the people who didn't get their to stories told in the first place. For people to know where, how we developed, where we came from, uh, children need to know where this, how the how this city started, and it's important to know those kind of things because that gives you a basic background of how we started and where we're heading toward. We have, you know, we're a fun organization and, and we're small and we're not like a big museum, but we're a museum that, it's kind of old fashioned museum. That's what we are. For more information on the museum and how to volunteer, you can visit museumoflocalhistory.org. This has been Kevin McDonald with Ohlone Tri-City News.